Hi, this is John Kanellopoulos here from our center in Athens, Greece. I'm gonna jump into a very interesting patient. This is a 32-year-old lady who had uh, LASIK recently in uh, central Greece, a very experienced surgeon, uh, great laser, the um, Wavelight uh, uh, EX500 Eczema and FS200 Femto, right eye, perfect vision, uh, 2016, great contrasensitivity. Left eye, she's complaining about dirty vision. The, the um, objects she sees are not uh, clear, are not stellar, uh, definitely much worse than the uh, right eye. We can see some diffuse haze here. We included in the um, differential diagnosis the possibility of uh, uh, DLK in this eye. And we can see in the contrasensitivity, and I'm jumping through all the um, uh, exams, that the left eye is, is definitely subpar um, than the right eye, which is here in the uh, uh, rhomboids and the average of the two eyes in the circles. And uh, all other exams, this is a good LASIK procedure, very well centered on the uh, uh, sign fluke imaging. This is the left eye, very similar to the right eye. Uh, we also went ahead and looked at the uh, higher aberrations with the Alcon site map and uh, very little oblique coma here um, on the uh, the right eye, uh, where the left eye appears to have no coma at all. So as far as uh, higher aberrations, left eye looks better. Contrasensitivity is worse. What's the diagnosis? Optic nerves are good. Diagnosis is that uh, probably uh, her high blood, high eye pressure rather than her left eye, which was measured 32 millimeters of mercury and adjusted for her cornea thickness, which is a little bit under 500 should be um, 35 to 36 is definitely different than the, um, the right eye, which measured nine. And the difference is that she's using uh, uh, dexamethasone in this eye for inflammation, uh, probably what we saw as a possibility of DLK, but unfortunately uh, our colleague here uh, did not uh, evaluate the eye pressure uh, careful enough to be able to make the diagnosis. So. We saved the day by doing something very simple, stopping the corticosteroid. We started the uh, beta blocker in the morning. This is her two days later. Vision jumped from uh, 2020 minus to 2016. Uh, we can see how stellar the cornea is compared to two days earlier. She had already subjectively feels she sees much better. And here's the proof in the pudding, how dramatically the contrastivity of the left eye has improved, has jumped into uh, average normal from being subpar and uh, we expect to improve uh, it to improve even further. Uh, thought it's a very interesting case to share as uh, we can appreciate uh, the pearls of uh, being very uh, uh, careful and very uh, uh, thorough on every uh, eye evaluation. Um, we also, since it has been reported in the literature, learned, look carefully at the anterior segment of CT to see uh, the possibility that she had developed a fluid pocket in the interface. This is something else to be very careful in post-LASIK patients because they may do that and that would uh, uh, make her acclimation measurements appear normal. Meanwhile, her intraocular pressure may be super high. So a steroid responder here, this needs to go on her record. Even a uh, inhaler or a nasal spray with steroids can make her pressure go up. Um, and a very happy patient with a minimal intervention on our side that uh, pivoted basically on the thorough evaluation of uh, intraocular pressure. Just going here through our standard of care and evaluating glaucoma patients, the uh, young Leon cell uh, layer, along with the um, ONH, the neurons around the optic nerve, normal on the right eye, and the similar pictures, uh, uh, this is the right eye again, similar pictures on the left eye, normal ganglion cell layer, and uh, again, the ONH, uh, all these are the, with the Avanti um, anterior segment OCT. So again, a very a happy patient uh, through a, uh, a very careful evaluation of intraocular pressure, which uh, uh, designated the difference in the steroid response in her left eye. Uh, hope you found this interesting. This is John Canopoulos uh, from our office here in Athens, signing out. Thank you.